Well, Kels, uh, 2020, first victory of 2020 comes today. Yeah. Uh, sum the game up for us. Um, I thought we were brilliant first half. Um, passed the ball really well. Um, had a few chances. Um, we're crossing from wide area. We're a lot better. Um, I managed to get a goal off a, a free kick. Um, and it was, yeah, it was, first half was brilliant. And then second half showed our, showed our ruthless side and dug in and stuck in there. And, yeah, it was brilliant. Being ultra critical, would you say that our play warranted more than a 1 0 victory? Yeah, definitely, yeah. Um, it's kind of been us the last few games now, really not taking our chances. Um, today could have cost us again, but luckily we managed to keep a clean sheet this time. And at the same time, it's like four points from the last two games. You can't really argue with that, can you? No, no, definitely not. Especially um, Port Vale away was just a tough game mm. um, under the circumstances today again now. Um, I thought the boys did really well, um, putting everything to one side and just carrying on with the game. Can't fault them. As you've alluded to, it's been a difficult week, let's say. Yeah. How much of today's victory was down to the mental resilience of the lads in that dressing room? Hugely, hugely. Um, I think every time we come out onto the pitch, there's a, there's a new issue that we've dealt with. Um, just to be honest, I think it's just kind of we just have to keep on going. Keep, you know, we've lost Daryl, who was brilliant to all of us. Um, we had a great relationship with him. I think when you go through so much with somebody, um, you know, you, you you build a great relationship with him. And we were sad to leave the same goal, but delighted that he's that he's got something else now, and we just have to carry on and keep doing our best for the club now. In terms of you as captain, um, how hard or how easy do you find it to motivate this group of lads every single week? Because as a supporter, as a fan, it's clear that they're giving absolutely everything, in, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, and I can only say the same in the in the change room. Um, they all, we're, honestly, the club is lucky to have this group of players. Um, each one of them have a tremendous attitude, um, just to stick in there, and that's all we can do at the moment with everything that's going on. Um, and when we come out onto the pitch, just try to do our best and demand that everybody gives their all and that's what they've been doing for us. So Another big home game, of course, next week, Oldham. Yeah. Um, how much are you looking forward to that and how much can we use today as a foundation to build on? Yeah, yeah. Um, we're playing Oldham who are in and around us again, I think. Um, so we need to start picking up points against these teams again. Um, and what better way to build on a, a win here. So hopefully we can do it again next week. And just finally, I think you know what's coming. The fans again, brilliant today, weren't they? Brilliant, brilliant. Came out in the numbers, they come out each week. Um, they've been so good to us, just helping us. I know, personally, I've gotten a few messages off fans saying, hang in there and things, and uh, they've been really good to us. So, can't fault them, they've been brilliant. Top man, thanks, mate. Thank you.